Hi and welcome back to Laran Gaming and if you are new to the channel, welcome. I, I am Laran and yes, it's Friday, it's Merchant Day, it's week 47. I do really expect an item rerun even this uh, week, but uh, that's just because, I mean, we are getting ocean number two this Sunday. So I am convinced that all the focus right now is to get that ready. And uh, we do have a countdown over here. One day, 17 hours, 15 minutes. So high expectations on that one, of course. And uh, yeah, and it's 16 minutes left until merchant spawns. Uh, I would, uh, well, regardless actually what I items that we're gonna see here at the merchant since I have no clue about if there are any other items in ocean 2 I assume that there will be I also think that uh, it's gonna be best to not spend anything right now at the merchant because if something else costs shards on Sunday I guess you want to spend it on those items instead if they are good and if there are no items, well, then anyway, <laughs> you do have the merchant and you can still buy whatever you want. So, okay, while we are waiting, let's go and take a closer look at the community. And there is a little less than one minute left. Any time now. And here we have it. The Wandering Merchant has arrived in Port Jackson. Week 47. <laughs> Alright. So let's see what we have here today. Um, I know many are wanting sunburst. I can understand that when you have something like an Ocean 2 coming. I see a big oof here. I quit. L. Nope. <laughs> Doesn't sound that good though. Alright, so let's go and check it out. Okay, so here we have it and I can understand the reaction. Pitchfork Spear, damage 160. We have the Jet Ski version 2 again. With a maximum health of 800 and a speed of 200. We also have the rare candy bait with a price of 25 shards. And we have the mystery bait box once again with 25 shards. And then we have the backpack, the school lunch box with a backpack space of 100. Alright, yes, okay. So let's start off with the school lunch box, the backpack. It has the storage space of 100, so it's very small. And it has a price of 35 shards. So I wouldn't expect anyone actually to buy this because of its backpack size. It's more like the model that is a little bit more interesting. So we're going to go into a free camera and check it out in a close up. So we got a nice texture. Actually a really cool fish theme texture. And a nice zipper. Yeah, it's a very nice looking model. And uh, I would assume that that's uh, why you would want to buy this one. Uh, but uh, we're also going to go and check for neon textures and if something can emit a glow. And of course, I really highly doubt that there are anything that emits any light. And as you can uh, clearly see, well, you can't basically see anything. So no lights, no glow, no nothing. So yeah, short review of that one. So that's the school lunchbox backpack. Nice. Then we have the Pitchfork Spear. It has a price of 40 charge and does a damage of 160, which isn't really that much. So I believe that's like 5 hits to get an Orca or a regular Shark. 
and uh, I believe that's a little bit on the low side so uh, yeah I don't think it will last that long to be honest uh, this is what it looks like in free camera so we're gonna take a closer look at it still a pretty cool looking model uh, but uh, yeah not really much more than that i believe <laughs> but we're also gonna of course uh, check for trails and uh, yeah it's dark out here so yeah you can clearly see that this spear well it doesn't emit any light any no glow no trail nothing basically we're gonna of course take a closer look over here in the dark and uh, just like the backpack we can't see anything so no neon textures no glow but if you are chasing different spear models just like the backpack you are a collector then it's a completely different story because then you can get these items for a very cheap price all right so let's move on yes and then we have the boat the jet ski version 2 and we're gonna take a look at it over here at the merchant first because we're gonna check the customization First of all, it has the health of a, up to 800 and it has the top speed of up to 200. You have customization options such as the light and this is colored light. So depending on what color you choose here, that is also the color it will emit when you use the light. You have the glass. I have chosen a transparent color. It's a ghost color currently because then it, uh, well, it feels like more like glass. And then we have the jet, which is the middle part here of the, these four different jets. You have the jet caps. They look yellow here, but I choose an, a neon texture, an orange one. Primary color is the main part of the body. And the secondary is like the seats and uh, the parts that you have underneath the jet ski. And of course, we're going to go and try it out. And also worth to mention, it has the price of 400 charge. I didn't mention that. So here we have it. It doesn't steer like a UFO, so you can't slide sideways or anything like that. So you steer just like a regular boat. It has some cool animations to the jets, however. So that is something that I really like. Very, very cool. It has a great top speed. With a top speed of 200, you're going to be pretty fast. Uh, but it does lack a little bit of turning speed, however. But nothing really of a big concern. It's good enough, I would say. And if we try out the lights also, if we can see some color. Yeah, as you can see, we have a red color right now on the jet ski. And you can clearly see the red color here because it has colored light. That is a very cool feature that I like a lot. And it also has this special sound, actually. Many boats has this regular sound that you keep here on every single boat model. But this one, yeah. You can hear different sound. It's not the regular boat sound. So that is actually really, really cool. So there you have it. That's the jet ski version 2. And when we jump into conclusions. This is a really special week. Because uh, we are getting the timeless tides. Uh, that's the second ocean in the game. And uh, since I don't know anything about any potential new items from that area. And if they gonna cost shards or not. I'm not really gonna actually crown a winner here at all. Because what if you spend 400 shards on this boat right now. And two days later when we get the ocean. Then you might see something that could be cooler. Well it's just a speculation. But just imagine what if. So I can't really recommend anything <laughs> of these items. However, the jet ski version 2 is definitely the coolest of the three. So yeah, I really like that jet ski in this case at least. So the backpack, that's just if you want to have some special models in your collection. And the spear, well I would say that's pretty much the same. So there you have it, a little bit more careful approach this week. Because yeah, I don't know anything about Ocean 2 basically. So I wouldn't be happy if I gave some bad advice here and someone spends charge on something that they will maybe regret. Alright, let's go back to Port Jackson. And just want to add one more thing, even if you decide to just wait and nothing special shows up on Sunday, the merchant is still going to be available, so you will not miss anything. So just keep that in mind. So I think we just need a little bit of patience this week until we know more about Ocean 2 and what that has to offer. All right, 
<laughs> enough of me rambling let's go back now well in any case that was all i had for you today if you do have any questions and comments about this please put them below like this video if you would like to see more content from fishing simulator please subscribe and yes have a nice day bye everyone